using the calipers. Using different parts of the calipers, three types of measurements can be taken. The external measurement, which is the outside diameter, as you see here, the axle size, and sprocket size and width. The depth gauge can be utilized to measure axle extension, seen here, and groove depths. Internal measurements can be utilized for measuring inside diameter, as you can see, and measuring between the sprockets. Reading the calipers. Read the ruler measure to the tenths of an inch, for example, 1.2 inches. Read the measurement along the edge of the tooth. When reading the ruler, the last whole digit is the number you use. You will notice that the edge of the 3 is visible, but there is not a line after the 3 before the edge. Therefore, the actual reading is a 2, because the last line you see is for the 2, not the 3. Read the dial number to the thousandths of an inch. For example, the dial reads 75. This equals 0 0.075. Add the two readings together for the final measurement. The ruler reads 1.2 inches and the dial reads 0.075. The measurement is 1.2 inches plus 0.075 inches and this equals 1.275 inches.